Good morning. We're doing a booty fitness practice today, so a mini band and some hand weights. I'm doing the uh, five pounds, but you can grab whatever, two pounds, five pounds. Just have them close to you. It's going to be, or three pounds, <laughs> and uh, it's going to be a quick 30 minutes. We're going to do full body, but a lot of uh, glute stuff. So let's come to stand. Okay, here we go. Legs wide. And shift the hips side to side. Start bending into the knee. Get a little lower. Sit your bum back. Get lower. Tapping your left hand to the right toes, right hand to the left, and keep going side to side for five, four, three, two. Hold on the right side and pulse. So now we're here. If you need to turn sideways on your mat, so left toes are up, right foot is down. Ground your right foot, spread your toes. Five, squeeze your right glute. Three, two, one, and we switch. So the right leg is straight and we're pulsing into that left glute. Spread the toes of the left foot. Squeeze the glutes equally. Four, three, two, one. Come up, walk the feet closer together if you need to so that we can get low into a double leg squat. And we pulse for 10, nine, eight. Squeeze your knees back, 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 back. Widen your knees, pull them back. Four, three, two, one. Face the front of your mat. Bring your left knee to bend. Take your hands to your mat. We come to table pose. Once you get into your table, hands under your shoulders, take your dumbbell under your right knee or behind your right knee. Bring your right leg up, bring your knee to your chest and bring it up. So we want to squeeze that right glute we want to squeeze the abdominal wall. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring the knee into your chest. Take the dumbbell with the left hand. Right toes to the back of your mat. Left arm forward. Lift the right leg straight. Lift the left arm up. Ten and down. Nine. Eight. So when you're coming up, spread the toes, push out of your heel, spread the fingers of your right hand. Five, four. Every time you lift, the belly gets stronger. Last two, last one. Knees down, hand down. Take the dumbbell to behind your left knee. Hands under your shoulders, left knee up. Squeeze the glute, bring it into your chest. Ten. Nine, eight, seven. Now uh, make sure that your hands are really strong here. Four more. Three, two, last one. Knee comes in, right hand takes the dumbbell. Left toes to the back of your mat, right hand to the front of your mat. Straight arm, straight leg lifts. 10, nine, Make sure your abdominal wall stays strong. Spread the fingers. Five, four, three, two, one. Come down to your knees. Take both dumbbells. Elbows bend at the height of your shoulders. We're just sitting on the knees. Exhale to bring the arms up. Inhale, elbows bend to the height of your shoulders. Exhale up, 10, nine. So when you exhale, squeeze your belly. It's an abdominal contraction every time. Five, four, three, two. Arms stay up. I'll turn this way so you can see me. We're lifting the hips, coming down and up. 10, nine. When you come up, Push your tailbone forward. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Keep 
the legs going, bend the elbows down and up for 10, go down and up, nine, eight, keep going. Don't let the elbows get too low. If you need to, you can drop the dumbbells completely down if you need to. Four more, let's go, keep going, keep going, almost done. Last two, last one, come down to table, right hand takes the dumbbell behind the right knee. Right hand is under your right shoulder, spread the fingers. Left hand has the dumbbell, lift the left arm and the right knee up, bring elbow and knee into chest. Ten, open, and in, nine. So remember, control your breath, push yourself out of your right palm. That's going to help to hollow the belly a bit more. Five more. Four. Three. Two. One. Foot or knee down. Take the dumbbell behind the left knee. Right hand has the dumbbell. Left hand under shoulder. When you're ready, left knee, right arm up. Elbow and knee to chest. Ten. Make sure you exhale when you come in. Eight, seven. Make sure the abdominal wall is strong when you pull the elbow in. Five, four, three, two, and one. Come down to your knees, taking both dumbbells again, one in each hand. Arms right down beside you, palms face inward. As we exhale, elbows go out and wide, thumbs turn down, and then come down, inhale. Exhale up, inhale down. Eight, seven, elbows higher than your wrists, lift from your elbows. Five, four, three, two, one. Come down, or sorry, bring your hands down tucking your toes. So notice how my hands are here holding the dumbbells. The knuckles are on the ground. Step your toes back so we come into a plank. Step your feet as wide as your mat. We do that for balance. If you need to, your knees can come down. Bring your right elbow back towards your right rib cage. Reach it forward. Pull it back. Nine. Eight. If you need to, knees are down. Six, belly firm. Don't let your hips be too high. Four, three, two, one. That's harder than it looks, eh? <laughs> so hand under shoulder, right palm, holding the dumbbell, toes as wide as your mat. Let's go, left arm forward, pull it back, row. Reach and pull back. Try not to dump into your right shoulder. Squeeze your abdominal wall. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Come back down. That's so hard. <laughs> so now, hands are holding your dumbbells. Tuck your toes. Come into downward dog. Bring your right leg up. Bring your right foot between your hands. We come into a lunge. Keep your chest leaning forward. Left leg is straight. Get your upper body in line with your back leg. So you're still leaning kind of forward. Elbows pull back. Bend the elbow. Oh, so, the, so the thumbs come to your armpits and then your thumbs go to your hips. Squeeze. When you straighten the arm, squeeze the back of the arm. Eight. Seven. Squeeze your left glute and sit more into your right knee. Push back with your left heel and push forward with your left hip. Five, four, three, two. Now we're changing it here. Ground into your right foot. We come up. Right knee to, sorry, left knee to chest. Hands to the shoulders. Bicep curl. Hands down, left toes down. Exhale up. Ten. So we're just staying on that left leg. Bring it knee to chest. Nine, eight. Seven. Six. Don't let yourself shift to the side when you're here. 
grounding into the bottom of your right foot by spreading your toes. Three, two, one. Foot goes down, right foot goes way back to that lunge. Leaning the chest forward. If you have a hard time with balance, just separate the feet wider to the edges of your mat, but keeping the bend in the left knee straighten and squeeze through that left leg. Elbows up, elbows straight, 10, nine. Squeeze your right glute, pull your right hip forward. Spread the toes of your left foot. Straighten that right leg as much as you can. Draw your shoulder blades down your back. Squeeze your belly, only four more. Three, two, one. Now left foot grounds and we come up. Right knee to chest, bicep curl. 10, nine, eight. You can keep both feet down if you prefer. Six, don't round your back, shoulder blades back. Three, four, three, two, one. Come to stand, center of your mat. Sit low, fingers are gonna go towards the, the toes. Now as we come up, the arms swing up, we straighten the legs, and as we exhale, we come down and the arms swing back. So let's go up, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, squeeze your glutes, five, four, three, two, last one, legs stay straight, hands come down beside you, spread the toes of your left foot, right toes go back, chest stays open, lean the, the body forward as the right leg goes up, and come back up as the right toes touch down. Left leg just slightly bent. Pull back up to center by using the left glute and the left hamstring. Squeeze the back of the leg. And you don't have to go too high to feel this. Five more. Four. Belly is strong. Smile. Three. Two and one foot down. Step your feet wide. Arms up. Sit low and come up. Ten, nine, eight. So we end up in a Y shape with the arms when we come up. Push your hips forward. Don't let your knees wobble inward. Three. Two, arms stay up, feet come together, spread the toes of your right foot, uh, yes, your right foot, arms come down, leg goes up, and then straighten the leg, touch it down, and keep moving. The right leg is straight, the right toes are spread, squeeze the right hamstring and glute to get you back up to center. Five more. Four, three, two, and one. Good job. Come to the top of your mat. Arms out in front. Bend your knees. Step your right foot back and chest in a line with your pelvis. So don't lean forward. Pulse up and down here for 10 nine, eight, seven. Shoulder blades are back. Four, three, pull your left hip back. And hands down, right foot next to left. Left toes go back, right arms, to, or both arms to the height of the shoulders. Sit low and pulse for 10, nine, eight. Shoulder blades back, collarbones open. Five, four, three, two, one. Left foot forward, hands right, uh, so arms are bent. 
As we inhale, the arms push forward and we sit back. Exhale, come up. Inhale forward. Exhale up. Eight. Seven. Six. Elbows wide. Five. Elbows as high as your shoulders. But let your shoulders come down. Last three. Last two. Last one. Come down. Hands in front of you. Bend the knees. Arms out to a T. Palms face down. Ten. Nine. Don't rush. Eight. Seven. Exhale on your way up. Six. Squeeze your glutes. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Hands down. Or sorry. Knees bend all the way down. Hands are still holding your dumbbells. Come to sit. As we inhale, we lower down. As we exhale, we come up. Ten. Nine. Eight. You can lose the dumbbells if you want. And use your hands to help hold you up. Just keep going. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Take your right hand down, dumbbell down. Does anyone have a watch? I don't know what time it is. Okay, we got nine minutes. So we're gonna lie on the right side. If you need to turn your mat to face me, whatever. So, we're on the right side. Oh wait, sorry, sorry, sorry. Grab your mini band. Put it on your ankles. Left hand has the dumbbell. Got it? So we're off of the right. So look at me for a second. I don't want you sinking down here. Push yourself out. Notice that left leg. Lift it and push from the uh, inner edge of the foot. Push from the inner edge of the foot. And then inner rotate your, your toes. Inner rotate your toes. Yep. Left hand holds the dumbbell. Now we inhale here. As we exhale, we lift the left arm and try to lift the left leg a little more. Inhale it down, but we don't soften the strap. Exhale up, inhale down. Now check in with the alignment of your abdominal wall. Don't let your right ribs fall towards your mat. Five, turn your toes in, turn your toes in. Yep, four, three, this is killing me, two, and one. Oh my gosh. You know, it's because we haven't done this in so long. I can really feel it. Flip onto the other side. Left elbow. Not that I'm complaining. Uh, on, underneath your shoulder. So remember, we're pushing out of the elbow. Right leg is up. Right hand has the dumbbell. Inhale to start. Yep, toes are in. And then exhale, arm up, leg up. Inhale down. Yeah, there you go. Lift. So it's not just a right side exercise, it's the left side as well. So the left arm is working, the left outer foot is working. Lift your kneecaps, five more. Exhale when you go up for power. Four, three, two, and one. Come down onto your back, taking the band on the thighs, just above the knees. Taking the dumbbells, one in each hand. Coming onto the back. Ground your feet in line with your hips. Lift your hips. Lift your arms. So from here, we're doing a chest press and we lower the hips as we bend the elbows. Inhale when we lower, exhale when we lift. 10, inhale down, exhale up. Nine, try to separate your feet enough. I know I said hip distance, but I want you to feel the band. So if you need to, widen your feet as much as you need to to get the tightness on the band. And then once you find that, don't let the knees change where they are. They're gonna wanna wobble. That's where you work to keep them steady. Three more. 
two. Last one, we're gonna hold here, palms face inward. The arms are gonna stay up. We're just lowering the hips and lifting up for 10 and down. Nine, eight, seven. Don't let the knees wobble. Six, really feel the hamstrings too. Five, four, three, two, last one. Hold the hips up. We're doing 10 mini pulses at the top. 10, 9, 8. Just the last inch of range at the top. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hips down. Dumbbells down. Taking the band to the top at your ankles. Interlace the fingers behind the right leg. Let the head stay down. Toes are pointing directly towards your forehead. Straight right leg and the arms are holding the right leg. Get your left heel as far away from you as possible and inhale it back to where it was. Exhale, pull it away from you. Squeeze that left glute. Inhale, back up. So when you're bringing it back up, don't let the band be soft. Exhale when you go down with that left heel. Inhale when you come up. The left glute and hamstring does not soften at any time through this set. Five more. Keep that glute engaged. Four. Pull your shoulder blades down and flatten them to your mat. Three. Big smile. Two. And exhale. Last one. Inhale. Hands interlace the left hamstring. Toes point towards your forehead. Notice if they're turning out. Turn them in. Right heel away from you. 10. Inhale it together and exhale away. Right glute, right hamstring active the whole time. 7. 6. Pull your shoulder blades down. Soften your jaw, soften your forehead. 4. 3. 2. And 1. Take the band again to your knees, just above the th knees to the thighs. Steph, what's the time? Okay. Take your feet to the edges of your mat. Actually, no, 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 sorry, sorry. Take your feet together, side by side. Arms are right down by your side. Lift your hips, widen your knees as wide as you can. Knees together, hips down. Lift widen together down lift wide together down I have to adjust it so whatever the band is best um, so that it's not sliding let's go six more five four three two now this next one hold it wide bottoms of the feet touch Drop your hips and lift. The knees stay wide. Ten and down. Nine, down. Eight, the knees don't change. Keep them wide, as wide as your mat if you can. Bottoms of the feet are pushing together. Five, four, three, two. Hold this next one. Pulse at the last inch of range of motion. Ten, nine. Make it a really small range. And the glutes don't relax at any time through this set. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Knees come in. Hands right down by your side. Palms are planted. Oh, sorry, feet are planted. As we inhale, arms reach back. Exhale, arms out to the outside right thigh. Inhale, arms reach back. Exhale to the left outside. Inhale, open. Exhale, right. Inhale, open. Exhale, left. Keep going. Ground your feet. One more on each side. Come to center. Arms for, uh, forward. <laughs> Take your dumbbells, one in each hand. Now the arms are going to go to the outside right of your leg. Both hands are holding your dumbbells. And let's pulse up. 10, 9, 8, 
seven, push your low back down, five, four, three, two, one, we're just switching and go, ten, nine, eight, seven, smile, five, four, three, two, one, come through center, both hands are holding the dumbbell, lift your knees, straighten your legs, knees above the hips, straighten your legs, nine, eight, seven, you can drop the dumbbells if you need, push your low back down, five, shoulder blades back, four, squeeze your belly to your spine, last two, last one, hands down, knees to chest, hands to knees, rock side to side, take the band off of the knees, bring the feet down, arms out to a T, right leg crosses over the left, let the knees fall left. Slow your breath down. Coming back to center, knees to chest, both hands to both knees, pull them in. And the right foot down as the left knee crosses the right, knees fall to the right, arms out wide. Slow your breath down. Try to take in four seconds in, five seconds out. Relax through your hips, relax through your knees, relax through your jaw. Coming back to center, hands behind the knees, roll forward to seated, crossing at the ankles. Bring your hands just down beside you, lengthen through your crown, bring your right ear to your right shoulder. Keep pressing your fingertips down. We're just trying to open up the side of the neck. Bring the chin back to neutral and left ear to left shoulder. Keep pushing fingertips down. Inhale, bring the head back up to center, over to the right, and then we're rolling to center, chin to chest and over to the left ear to left shoulder, chin to chest, right ear to right shoulder, and just go a few times side to side. Finishing on the left. Holding the chin up to neutral, arms up. Interlace the fingers and exhale, palms to the sky, lift the chin. Pull your shoulder blades back, pull them down, open the chest, take a deep inhale. As we exhale, knuckles to the River as we round the back, chin to the belly button. Coming back up as we inhale, flip the palms to the sky, lift the chin, and exhale, knuckles away from you, round the back. Try to get the forehead to touch your belly button. One more, inhale, lift, palms to the sky, exhale, and round, knuckles forward. Arms up, inhale. Arms out wide and exhale. We just twist to the right, center, twist to the left. Go a little quicker. Last three, two, one, and center. Hands to heart, big smile, inhale. Out of the mouth, let it go. Have a wonderful Friday. <laughs>